Hi guys, welcome back to JIV. In this video, I am going to share one of the most important Java 8 questions which is shared by our subscriber. This question is asked in many interviews. In this video, I am going to explain how exactly you can solve this problem. I have a question using Java 8 stream API. Find the employees who is living in Chennai and have salary more than 50,000. So I assume we have a list of employees and from this list of employees we have to find the employees who are living in Chennai and have salary more than 50,000. Also with the question it is given that we have an employee object. Inside employee object we have a, we have a variables like name age, address and salary. Now to solve this problem, let me just quickly create an employee object. So I will create an employee class and inside the employee class we have some parameters. Parameters like I have name of employee, then I have address of employee. This address is another object. Let me just create the address object here itself. Apart from address, the employee will have salary as well. In the address class, we have fields like first it will be city, then I have state and last thing I have country. Now I will create, first I will create setter getters for address class and then I will create setter getters for employee class. Now here in our main class, first I will try to create a list. I will try to create a list which will have all the employees. So this list is type of employee. Let's name it employee list. Now we have to add all the details in this employee list. Now to add this, we will use constructor of employee class. So I will quickly create a constructor as well in this class, which will take the values. Now I will create a constructor for address as well. Now I will add a new employee object into this list and I will pass name, address and salary. So name may be from address is another object. So I will add Mumbai, Maharashtra. I will use this line and copy it multiple times to add multiple employees. I will just change the names. So as you can see, I have added all the employees, five employees into this list. Now we have to find the employees who is living in Chennai and have salary more than 50,000. Now to do that, I will use this employee list. First step will be, I will create a stream out of this employee list. And then I will use the filter method. And inside the filter meter, uh, method, I will filter all the employees who's having salary more than 50,000. So. Now the another condition is the person is living in the Chennai which means I will get the address and then I will get the city and city should be equal to Chennai. Now this stream has all the employees who's having salary more than 50,000 and living in the Chennai. Now I have I have to print this. I will use for each method and uh, I will use method reference here to print this. Let's just run this program. Now what is happening, it is printing the employee object, not the details, but we want details. So what I will do, this println method internally uses two strings. So what I will do, I will go to this employee class and then I will override the two string method as well. And now I will again run this program. So as you can see, I can see this detail, but, but at this detail is not visible because I only overrided the two string method in the employee class. I haven't overrided the two string method in the address class. So I'll do that here as well. And I will run this program again. So now you can see all the details about the employees whose salary is more than 50,000 and city is Chennai. So I hope this 
video will be helpful for you uh, let me know in the comment section what you guys think about this video and uh, i will see you in the next video thank you